Hi everyone, it's Valerie. Welcome to the Five Waiting Wombs channel. This week's topic is the Family Act of 2011. This act, also called Senate Bill 965 or House Bill 3522, was introduced in 2011. Unfortunately, it died in committee. Wah, wah. The bill would provide a tax credit up to 50% of medical expenses for infertility treatments or for um, fertility preservation treatments, which is pretty good. So it kind of mirrors the adoption <clears throat> um, act that provided a, a tax credit for adoptions in that this would provide for infertility treatments. There is a lifetime cap of $26,720. There is also an income um, limitation put. So a couple can only make up to $222,500 to get the full um, lifetime cap. Otherwise, those amounts drop. Um, and they don't say specifically how much, but they do drop if you make over that $222,500 as a couple. This act really needs to be brought up again for debate and hopefully a vote and moved forward because just like the support that was given to couples and individuals who adopt, the same should be afforded to all of us who are going through infertility treatments. It's not that we're looking for handouts, but given the exorbitant costs just to build our families, this would be such a great help. What would really tickle my fancy is if there was an amendment to the original bill that would then say that all fertility treatments are covered under all insurance. That would just tickle my fancy. But I dare to dream. So I'll just stick to how the act is currently written. It is written and it is a good thing and you can get more information out on the resolve.org website. Also, maybe time to place a call to your senators and congressmen and just say, hello, I am voter. I want you to take up the Family Act of 2011 and I'd like to see it passed. 2014 elections are coming around, and so is 2016. I'll just have to remember this as a couple that's fighting infertility or an individual who's fighting infertility. We have to really stand up, take a little, um, kick a little dust around, so to speak. This act really needs to get passed. We all should be keeping a close eye on it. Anyway, that's my little spin on it. Hopefully you learned a little bit more. I hope you have a wonderful weekend. Don't forget to subscribe to the Five Waiting Wombs if this is your first time to this channel. My channel also will be, a link will be provided below. Stop by, see what vlogs I have up. Take care everybody. Bye. Thanks for watching. Straight kick and dates on the weekends had a string like a vibe.